Coming to us all the way from California, this is a favorite of ours, Habby Cam, big time supporter of the show. You've seen the shoulder brace that, uh, that they sent us and, and we featured on our show a few times. Now they've got something uh, additionally as cool. Uh, we're calling this the Habby Cage. You notice it's a standard Canon 7D DSLR. Also, the 5D will fit in this cage. What does it do? Well, uh, quite obviously, right off the bat, it comes with rod support system. Now, there are a lot of rod support systems out there. Some are really, really expensive. Cool thing about this Habby cage, $599, you got the cage, and you got the rod support system. You can put your lens control systems. You can put anything that's got a quarter-inch thread, so your Zoom audio recorders, your Israeli arms for your built-in monitors. We're going to get to the monitors a little bit later. Your wireless receivers, all kinds of stuff. You got unlimited amounts of holes on the cage to mount those items to it. Um, one, one quick criticism, it's a little bit uncomfortable to hold handheld, but that is quickly dispersed when you realize the utility of the mounting system. Number one, quarter inch and, and three eighth inch holes here, so you can put this on your large size tripods. Additionally, this little mounting system, whether you've got the rod system on it or not, mates directly to the Habby cage, excuse me, to the Habby cam, Habby brace. So, you line them up like this, spin a little knob, and now all of your heavy stuff on your camera fits right on your shoulder mount. Pretty awesome, right here. Nice and easy. And you'll notice on the back of my shoulder mount right here, we've got an official Habicam two pound counterbalance. It connects to the quarter inch mounting threads with two little Allen wrench screws. Pretty awesome, very handy, and it really takes the weight off the front. You can also double up if two pounds isn't enough for you. If you want to balance it out a little bit better, add more heavy weights on the back. Uh, clearly, a lot of thought went into the design here. Why do I say that? Well, uh, again, it's, it's designed for either tripod or shoulder-mounted use. It's not the best in handheld, but you wouldn't really want to use this in conjunction with handheld anyway. Why? Well, you want to be able to add your accessories to it. And in order to add your accessories to it, there are some really smart additions to the cage. Number one, this hole right here. You got me, Jose? There's a hole right here that allows you to plug in your monitoring cables, your power adapters, all the stuff to get into this side, totally open and available. Number two, on the battery side, another hole right here. So I can easily open up my battery compartment and eject my battery and switch it out without having to do anything about dismounting the camera. Pretty sweet. In the same vein, right here on the side of the camera, I can open up this door and eject my compact flash card switch it out when it's full, put a new one right in here. If you've got an accessory that is not really well designed, they might not have thought that all the way through. Our buddies at Habicam totally did. Totally did. And the final little piece de resistance. It's tough to see, but there's a little claw system, and it's right here. Jose, can you get any of that? Right here. So there are two movable claw pieces, all right, with, with, uh, with Allen wrenches, with Allen wrench screws that allow you to lock your camera in place so that it doesn't have any horizontal panning left or right. Right here and right here are claws, adjustable, that squeeze the camera in place where you intend the camera to be so that you can keep it on the exact horizontal plane that you want it without allowing the camera to slip around. So, well designed, well thought out. Uh, I'm, I'm a big fan of this cage. You had a tripod here, you put your plate right on the bottom, stick it on, add all your very heavy accessories, monitors, audio receivers, those kinds of things, and uh, for $5.99, really makes a production piece out of an otherwise sort of bare camera. A lot of fun. Cool, so thanks to our friends at Happy Cam for sending this stuff out. It's Jesse Miller approved.